What is up, my dudes? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Jesse, and just in case you're new here, I go hunting for Hot Wheels every single day, and then I crack them open right here on Daily Diecast. Now, today is a very special episode for me, very nostalgic. This episode is all about funny cars. I used to love these cars when I was a kid. The fact that the whole body like opened up and you can see the inside, the custom chassis and bodies just really stoked me out. And of course, when I was a kid, I was way more into drag racing. I would check that out on TV all the time. But before we do that, check this out. I got another one of these awesome cases. Another 12 car case and it is again in amazing condition absolutely awesome love these cases i'm trying to get uh, as many as i possibly can you know what let's let's keep eh, we'll be able to see it that well all right let's go ahead and just leave it right there in the background and let's get to cracking open some of these awesome funny cars starting with this one right here now this one is a mustang funny car team drag racing there's the whole card right there now i wasn't collecting back then so let's see what year it is more or less it says 2007 so, uh, you know, somewhere around there, seven, 2008 maybe. There's the rest of the card. Very cool. I'm super anxious to crack some of these open, so let's go ahead and get started with the cracking. Oh man, <laughs> that one doesn't want to come open. There you go. All right, and here is the first one. Check that out. How oh, neat. El Capitaz, Hot Wheels Finest. I'm trying to read the, oh, there we go. Fraser's Fiberglass Limited. Awesome. And then over here, what does that say? Oh, I honestly don't know. <laughs> but this is really cool. It's got some orange windows. Of course, it has the blown motor. There's the metal base. I imagine they're all gonna be metal bases. And let's see how easy it is to open. Oh, there we go. It's a bit stiff, but it does open. Check that out. There's the exhaust, the engine, the cockpit. And that was one of the things, uh, you know, uh, that, that defined a funny car, was that the engine was in front of the driver. In some drag racing classes, you know, it was behind the driver. All right, so let's go ahead and crack open this next one. Uh, now this one, is also a Mustang funny car. And this one has a little bit more detail. I really like the purple paint on this one. I like the fact that it has a Goodyear Eagle uh, riding on the rear tire. And let's check out the back. This one says 2009, more or less. All right, let's open it up. Let's check it out. Now, I wonder if these are gonna fit on the plano wall. I honestly don't think they will, but it's all good. I'll find a spot for him. There we go. Oh wow, that one's so sick. Hot Wheels tempo on the side, nice flames. Again, big old five spoke. The Goodyear riding on it. That purple paint just looks amazing. There's the front. I'm not sure if we checked out the front on this one. Not much going on with the flat black one. But there's a lot going on with this purple one. Awesome. This one has a wheelie bar. Did the other one? Oh, it did too. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> so yeah, let's go and open this one up too and take a look at this one. More or less the same. Pretty much the same thing going on there. This one has clear windows though, which I think is pretty awesome. Love the variety. So there's those right there. Maybe it's moving just a little bit. There we go. And this next one is actually a treasure hunt. I guess back in the day, they had this big green stripe on the card making it a little bit easier to find the treasure hunt, I imagine. And this is a Challenger funny car. Let's take a look at the back of the car since we had this opportunity to do so. Same, same era, 07, 08, somewhere in there. And of course there's some info on the car if you wanna check it out. All right, let's rip it open and let's take a look at this treasure hunt more closely. This is only like my fourth treasure hunt. Well, I mean, a second regular treasure hunt. And then I have two super treasure hunts, which I have not shown you guys yet. But anyway, here's this one, the Challenger. Cool, like metallic brown paint. Almost spectrified. No, no, it's metallic for sure. 
Awesome, I love that it says treasure hunt right there on the hood and right there on the door, well, I mean, the faux door. Nice exhaust coming out the side. Same wheels, just doesn't have the writing on the tire, unfortunately. There's a parachute, no wheelie bar, but it does have a parachute. This one is really cool. And let's go ahead and open it up. Oh, this one opens up, okay, it's not gonna stay. This one doesn't wanna stay for some reason, but it opens up a little bit wider. So I have to figure out a way to prop that open. I know some of the really old Hot Wheels had like a little plastic thing that propped it up. It's kind of a bummer though. I wanted to be open with the other ones. Hmm. You know what? Hold that thought. Jump cut. All right, let's try this and see if it works. There we go. That should keep it open. All right, let's do the next one. Now I have two really awesome ones left. Let's go ahead and do this one next from the Hot Wheels Classic Series, which I love so much because I get with Series 2. Really like these, these are so awesome. Check out the back, looks like it was more or less 05. Little list of all the cars. And the seller threw in one of those Protecto packs, let's go ahead and take out of that first. There we go. Now we can see it without the glare. Look at that, that is awesome. Very cool, Plymouth Barracuda funny car. Beautiful blue paint. All right, this one opened up much nicer than the other ones. <laughs> oh, cool, check that out. That is so awesome. Let me adjust the light here a little bit. Maybe it helps to see the paint. Again, with those ones are sometimes some package wear because I do consider this to be Spectra Flame, which is really just kind of a transparent um, paint over a bare metal polished body and that's why it shines like that Hot Wheels classics and we got all the All the race livery there and this one also has the writing on the tires this time both front and rear Which I love Very very cool. All these bases are pretty much the same Oh, this one is considered snake like as in snake and mongoose Interesting it has the Hot Wheels vintage right there very awesome let's go ahead and open it up hopefully it lets me yes it's very stiff but it does let me do it. oh wow this one has oh see this one has that thing i was telling you about see it has like that little piece of plastic to hold it up. it doesn't need it though as you can see it's it's staying on its own but it does have this piece of plastic just in case you know in the future it wears out but you can prop it up with that there we go let's just go ahead and use it since we have it awesome check that out it's so cool Man, I'm loving this episode so far. All right, and the very last one I have to open up today is this fella right here. Looks like it's from the 30th anniversary in 1998, I guess. Yeah, 1998, it sounds about right, more or less. Authentic commemorative replica of the Firebird funny car. You guys know how much I love my Firebirds. Let's check out the back of this package real quick since I'm about to destroy it. So cool. Very awesome. And there's all the other ones you can get in the series. Awesome. Totally, but you guys know me. I am not a package collector. So I'm just gonna go ahead and crack this open so we can check out the car. There we go. There is this outside of that external package. Very, very clean. Very, very old school looking. There is the back. Collect all 30 authentic commemorative replicas or just your favorites. <laughs> yeah, totally. Uh, super cool. All right, so let's go ahead and crack this open. There we go. It wanted to stay in there. But there we go. It has nice big black walls in the rear, small ones in the front. Love that Firebird Tampo. So sick. Oh my goodness. 
That metallic slash candy red is amazing. Blue tinted windshield. Of course, the exhaust coming out the side. This one has parachutes back there, but no wheelie bar. Pins oil on that side. Is that on the side? Yeah, there he is. Just love that awesome Firebird tempo. So sick. This one does not have that plastic pop-up thing, but it's all good. Doesn't need it. Nice chrome engine and cockpit. So sick. Wow, these cars are just so awesome. So nostalgic for me. I, I seriously used to play with cars like this when I was a kid. Like They were my favorite, the ones that like popped up like this. Love funny cars. So much fun to collect. I don't even care if they're not going to fit on my Plano wall. I'll figure out a different way to display them. No big deal. Uh, you guys, uh, let me know which one your favorite was down in the comments. And if you enjoy collecting Hot Wheels like I do, please subscribe to the channel and like the video. Again, my name is Jesse, and I post Hot Wheels videos every single day, and I will see you tomorrow.